Hello, everybody. Or oh. boy, I haven't done this. I had to do something. Not that it really matters. Just desktop audio. I that when I capture card. I did. <clears throat> desktop. <laughs> Once it gets in there. Anyway, play this in a while. Elden Ring. Fall off. So many other. <laughs> Gotta get used to it. Don't mind me. Fun game. I'm already looking forward to the next weekend because uh, I want to play it some. And just... I think I did like um burned out campfire some. Who might you? Traveler. <laughs> Only one reason people will go poking around out here in the middle. They're after us three, aren't you? Helps oh, properly. How wrong? Never beat. Them. I bring good luck to myself wherever I go, and I'll, I'll luck and ill luck anyone who crosses our paths. I'm the eldest. I'll be your lucky charm. Thought you spotted a four-leaf clover. Well, I'll soon have you see double. I'm the middle sister. I'm one clover. You. Heads. I win. Tells you got no chance. Coin. Definitely not. This bandit trick of the misfortunes. Left. Like, why are they like Sentai villain? Let me handle this. I'll only hurt her. On toxic cows this. Oh, well, I've got a whole party of folks. Point. Cow. Not effective. Shit. I forgot what the symbols use. Or what the symbols meant. I Battle theme. 
I'm not fond of this outcome, but at least it's still better than plowing field galaxy. Hmm. Galaxy team. Oil things. After I take the blasted fragment and go. Was a lot. Oh. I like how there is like. See that the. Weird writing on it made us take them. Kind of treasure. It's trying to be a worthless slab of junk. All that effort. Tell me, how are you even. Oh, what? Goodness, how selfless of you. Go so far away. All of us have the luxury of offerings up. Some of us simply diving in another. I've got a score to sell with the galaxy. That includes. Remember what those. Why is it. Off correct. Awesome. These are also no. Galaxy. A lot of just like. Straight up promises of death and. I like that. I always forget how big Raichu is. I'm so sick of Venoshock. I don't think those have anything. A little worried because I think microphone. Then uh picking stuff up the way you wrong button. <laughs> okay, one sec. Let me Uh, something has gone up with my microphone. Pause the record. Okay, and I am recording once again. Sorry about the beginning of that being a little crusty. Um, I don't know. My microphone just... Again, I mentioned it before uh, during streams. Uh, I think the last time was during Resident Evil. My microphone does not like to cooperate um, with trying to get the the gain the way I want it to be. It's a little annoying, but it sounds good now. I don't, it like keeps resetting, like, when I turn my PC off or whatever. Like, I don't know. It's weird. Or when it goes to sleep. Something about, like, the change in power or something. The, the, it, the settings get fucked up because the settings don't even make sense. They're, like, arbitrary. I don't know how to explain it. They're, like, uh... Some values... Will, like... No, again, it's so strange. I could, like, probably demonstrate it. So, uh, but pretty much, let's say I have it at 60. 60 could be quiet. And then I turn it down to 22, and suddenly it, it's loud. It, it it doesn't work properly. It doesn't, or at least it doesn't work in the way that you would think. But, um... I don't, I don't know what to do with it. I was trying to reduce background noise. And it's just become an absolute headache because there was, like I said, there was this weird like noise that I could hear in my 
voice uh, when I was like checking back like older recordings or testing it and now it's um now it's very difficult to manage Very tired today because I stayed up so late playing Hitman. <laughs> oh, so you've come to bother me again. Oh, oh, so you've come to bother... I don't know. Well, come as often as you'd like, but it won't change my mind. This wall fragment. What? You went to retrieve the fragment from those bandits? Is the, is the Bidoof also, like, shocked? Why go out of your way the f like that for a complete stranger like me? I guess you're that eager to come, Ursuluna. Hmm. If possible. I'll admit I didn't expect anybody else to truly care for Ursuluna. Well then, let's see that war fragment. And there we go. Good as new. Unknown. All. Is it all. All loves? <laughs> uh. Something, something. Let me read what it says. All lives. Oh. To. All lives touch other lives to create something anew and alive. I see. I suppose it means people helping each other, like how you helped retrieve the fragment. I've read this passage many, many times, but this is the first time I've truly understood what it means. Maybe this is Almighty Sinnoh's guidance. <laughs> Oh, sleepy. What is your name then, girl? I see. Otato. Please lend me your strength so that we may help Ursaluna. It's true that Ursaluna has become enraged, but he doesn't seem to be in an utter frenzy. I think he will return to his normal state if we can just give him some medicine. I can never bring myself to engage Pokemon in battle. But that's something I can rely on you for, am I right? Ursaluna prefers to stay on Sludge Mound. Please join me there when you're ready. Hi. I need to go to... Somewhere else. I need to go back to the camp. That was a request over there. Oh, goodness. I've been kind of slacking on the request. Oh, sir. Alright, Laventon. Can you heal my Pokemon? Tato, I think you've got something stuck to you. <gasps> An unknown! A. Was that a Pokemon? Come to think of it, Velo did mention that there were carvings that resembled writings on the wall of the Solesan ruins. But supposing that the Pokemon we just saw is a species with multiple forms, perhaps the carvings are actually likenesses of this very Pokemon. I'm going to add a section specifically for that species to your Pokedex, Otato. On own notes were added to your Pokedex. What's this now? I don't like markings seem to have appeared in this section I've just added. And was that... Your awk phone, I just heard. If your mysterious device is reacting to this new species, I wonder what it could mean. It's the Y button while doing the cover of your Pokedex. You're up to your IO research notes. By deciphering the cryptic symbols found in these notes, you can find you can try to find all the unknown hiding throughout the region. These unknown possess a mysterious power that repels Pokeballs containing Pokemon. So you won't be able to battle them, but you can track them down and catch them all if you can. Uh, no, I don't... 
If Choi at the general store can just get some different good stock, I'll have more to sell. Oh, don't mind me. Have you got your Pokemon team, your items already for your excursion? I could use a rest. Uh, let's just rest until morning. Alright. Healed, happy, and healthy again. Pet Grace for Pokemon. Hey there! You're that go-getter from the Survey Corps, right? I have a request for you, if you got some time. I'd love to know more about that Pokemon called Roselia. It has these gorgeous red and blue flowers for hands. Such a graceful Pokemon. I often come to the Golden Lowlands to admire the Roselia, but just watching them from afar isn't enough for me anymore. Do you think you could complete Roselia's page in that Pokedex of yours and show it to me? A row... Every rose has its four thorns. Something. Is that Badu? Badu evolves into Roselia, right? Get caught, nerd. Nice tail smack, Raichu. Can we just, like, snipe this Pokemon? Ooh. Beautiful. Didn't get caught. I gotta try it again. We're just gonna catch him. Got, oh, he's angry. He's angry. Let's hit him with a quick little ember, no big deal. He's battering. Can you switch? I don't want to kill it. Uh, I think it's going to get killed. Maybe not. Maybe not. Okay, we're going to use this here Pokeball. Oh. We did it. Walk it the monster. Oh, is Psyduck trying to start beef with me? Well, you're done, fool. Foolishness, Psyduck. Foolishness. You don't have type advantage. Do a one hit KO. KO! Apricorn. That's what? And, oh, jump is wide. Tangle. Tangela? I almost said Tangler, so that would be actually just completely dumb of me to say because it's just Tangela. Alright. Remember the last time I've seen a game with Tangela in it? A new Pokedex entry. Oh. Got him. Oh. What type is Tangela? I don't even know. Uh. Leafage will work. 
Oh wait, no, leaf hitch will not work. Uh, so we can go with quick attack. Poison pattern. Okay, uh, swift. Oh, that worked. That's good, it doesn't have any effect. Uh, Pokeball. Nice. I caught a Tangela. Oh, oh no, it's alert. See if Kolava can fight it. Uh, flame wheel. How did the Pokemon Stadium announcer do it? He's like, oh, flame wheel, or something like that. Pokemon Stadium had like so many great announcer lines. Seems to be waiting for its opponent's next attack. Wait. Oh no. Oh no. Oh god, they're after me. This is the wrong neighborhood. Yeah, I gotta get out of here. Oh, this place is stinky. Oh, oh goodness. Oh dear. Can't believe I'm in my fucking blight town. Yeah, and they, they are all after my ass. Dodge roll. It's Elden Ring. There, that's a Pokemon in there. It's so small. That's oh, Krogunk. Get in the ball, man. They're fast. How to waste dozens? Oh, wah! Aster for me. Yeah, how to waste dozens of Pokeballs in one easy step. Person up there. Music. That was a little nutty. That skybox. Pretty nice looking, to be honest. There's a Pokemon nearby. Ow! My ankle. One's shaking. So there's probably a Geo dude in there. Let's 
check it out. Oh my god. It's a graveler. Oh, well, let's hope it doesn't kill Leafeon. Iron defense, okay. Rock slide. Oh, nice. Leafeon, you're the best. She's a great ball. Thing's level 27. Yeah. Raffler was caught. Big XP. Another request over here. Who's this guy? What's up, homie? Nope, time for old person voice. Oh, hello there. So you're the Survey Corps' child who quelled the Lord of the Woods, are you? Think you could help with setting up our new base camp? We're making one by the bogs. Our Odo could sure use someone as capable as you. He's a fresh construction corps recruit, still learning the ropes. The Baga Bound. The Bog Bound Camp. Okay. Let's, uh. Oh. Oh. Missions and requests. Hey, I have a lot of requests that I haven't done. <laughs> Sorry, I figured I'd do them on my own, and then I just haven't played this game at all, because I've just been so busy with, uh... with Elden Ring. <laughs> well there, I'd keep your distance if I were you. Just look at those bothers. They're taking the spot where I was going to set up base camp. One stunky would be a headache, but this little group is a full-blown migraine. Maybe I can get someone else from the team to handle this. Someone good at battling. I'll drive them all. Are you sure you're up to this? Though, they stink something fierce. Leave it to me. Well, if you insist, but you've got to beat three of them, so be ready to run and stay downwind. Their faces look like butts. Target's offensive stats? Does that lower all their stats? Oh no, just the one. Yeah. Um. Do I get info? Alright, let's try switching to Drift Moon. Fusion doesn't work. Oh, fuck. Um... Never mind. For lava. Don't be poisoned. Oh no. I need medicine. Uh, super potion. Oh no. Alright, that's... 
to flame wheel, I guess. Poison gas. Poison nerve gas. Go with Swift. Ah, uh, Raichu. Oh, my goodness. Let's go with. Thunder Wave. Oh my god, a critical? Bro. Alright. Worm. Worm a damn. Only no struggle bug. Oh, I just realized yeah, the CL to change the target. Oh god. Psyduck. Wash away the anger. Uh, bubble. Uh, I guess do water pulse. I don't know. Do a straw and water pulse. Try to finish it here. Dang. That's some gains to shit. You weren't kidding. You've got talent, and your Pokemon were so brave, too. I can't believe you handled three Stunky all by yourself without getting smelly. Thanks to you, we can get the base camp set up now. Hold on a minute. There we go, what do you think? Makes things feel a little safer out here, no? There's not a whiff of Stunky here either. Stop by any time. This makes the second base camp for us to use in the Crimson Mirelands. Perhaps some Stunky will pop by for fun and games sometimes, eh? Oh, wouldn't that be a treat? Stunky, more like stinky. Went to do some shopping. I don't have enough money. Oh. I can sell some items. I suppose. Rip dust. Oh, I should probably use that. Sword cap. So good. Uh, 
Water stone? Oh, wow. I didn't even know I had that. That storage. Two fire stones. Uh, let's move that. All I want to do, I wanted to use. Uh, speed. Five of them, I guess. There we go. Got to give some stuff to my boy for lava. Let's uh, actually save real quick. Is that a ghastly? Heard it out of my right ear. Yes, ghastly. I'm so catching that ghastly. No, he disappeared. Yeah. Back strike with a great ball. Guess it's poison gas. Let's use Astonish. Oh. Well, I didn't want to beat it. Oh god, stunky. Yo, what the fuck? They're just haunters? Hunters are big boys. Okay, Drifloon. Fight the Haunter. No, that's what I was gonna do. Use the great ball. We did it. That's Pog. Who sees me? Geo dude. Oh, it's Geo dude. Leafage. Oh, wait, you want to start shit? Hit 
Hippopotas. Yeah, that's right. Uh, I guess I should have seen that coming. Swift Astonish. Agile style. And we can use a Pokeball to maybe catch it. Ah. Uh. What? Why does it have to go twice? Alright, Psyduck. You must use Hypnosis. Avoided the attack, are you kidding me? Oh no, Hex. Can't believe it hexed me. There we go. Jeez. That was harder than the Haunter. Excuse me. Oh, you? I didn't mean to send out Quilava. Just flame wheel. Okay. That worked. Can't really be sneaky over here. Please catch. Oh, I guess I should have expected that one. Uh, that's level 46. What? Yo, he just teleported. Oh wait, jump is Y. I keep pressing A. Ah! Yo, why can't you double jump like Torrent? <laughs> What the fuck? What are you? Oh no, I cannot swim. Can I just... Can I just travel to the camp? I'd like to rest. And so would my Pokemon. Right, let's let's do the next story bit, I suppose. Enough goofing around. Over here, Otato. 
Ursaluna is enraged, yes, but he must still recall his long relationship with the Pearl Clan. He never fails to show up the moment I play my Celestikia flute. Why is it always the same notes? Rawr. Now show your metal to Ursaluna, but remember that Ursaluna is a Pokemon very dear to the Pearl Clan. I will not permit you to catch him. Oh shit. Uh, flame wheel. Ah, yes, fool. Oh. Okay. Side up. Go with hypnosis. Okay. All right, let's go leafage. What, you have baby dolls? Fuck off. Quick attack. I didn't really do much damage. Uh, let's go with baby doll eyes. Okay, cool. Nice. Oh, man. Ursaluna, my poor darling, you must be exhausted from running around like that. Come, let me make you all better. I have a special medicine of the Pearl Clan. Now clear out any poison in a Pokemon's body. If poison's what's causing Ursaluna's rage, this is sure to calm him down. We call it Toxagon. Toxagon. I've infiltrated the sneak point. It's so potent, we can only use it on tough, resilient Pokemon like Ursaluna. There, there, dear Ursaluna, you've calmed down now, haven't you? It's very strange, though. He wasn't really frenzied. Very astute of you, Galaxy Team Recruit. You're exactly right. When you quelled Cleavor's frenzy, you could see a strange light rising into the sky all the way from here. No such strange light erupted from Ursaluna after you defeated him, nor was he glowing. And what is this cleaning to Ursaluna's coat? It seems like some kind of powder. That girl from the Diamond Clan, Erizu. Now, why did she of all people find the need to come and tell me about Ursaluna, I wonder? Oh, but I almost forgot something important. Play your Celestikia flute for me, won't you? <laughs> Ursaluna opened his heart and learned well the sound of your playing. A stone tablet imbued with the essence of the earth. Ursaluna is very good at finding things that are buried in the ground. We see that he is digging for treasure, even if these treasures may not always glitter or gleam. 
Now go and let your commander know what transpired here, child of the galaxy team. Brrr. You now call Ursaluna and dig for treasure. Ursula will rush towards any treasure he finds in front of him, or senses in front of him. Press the Y button to dig for treasure. When Ursaluna finds a spot that makes him react particularly strongly, you might find something very nice. Oh, okay. But can I ride? I can ride him, too. Cool. Oh, look. Okay, I see how that works. Interdasting. So you've caught 20 Pokemon. Care to report your findings? Oh, wow. Money, money, money. Oh, -ho, it seems you've made some new observations. Let's have a look then. Mm, I see. Most illuminating. I'll update our Pokedex with the new data. Do, 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 do. Six hundred and seventy points. So what would you like to do now? To return to the village. Right oh, with the security force escorting us. It'll be a nice safe trip back to Jubilife. You're back. Get to the commander's office quick. Oh, okay. Be doof. Pokemon nobles are seriously powerful. Pokemon that protect the Diamond and Pearl clans. It's terrible to think that you're even stronger than they are. Beautifred. Okay. Tano, we have a situation here. Let me explain. Lilijin, our clan's Lady of the Ridge, is in a frenzy. And Arizu knowingly kept this from me. A Lilijin? Yes, there are only female Lilijin, which makes this honored one our Lady of the Ridge. But this isn't the time for cultural lessons. I'd like to find out just what Arizu was thinking, but she's nowhere in Jubilife Village. Last I saw, she was in the wallflower, polishing off a big old plate of potato mochi. Not that I blame her, my cooking is simply irresistible after all. If Arizu... Oh, what was his... Oh, it was, if Arizu of the Diamond Clan was somehow involved in the situation with the raging Ursaluna of the Pearl Clan, it could lead to the two clans going at each other's throats again. Tell me, Commander, if we do end up in a struggle with the Pearl Clan, what will your people do? We would be forced to remain neutral. Meaning what? If we were to show support for one side, it would put us at odds with the other. We came here to create a home for ourselves, not to take part in tearing the land apart. Right, of course. After all the work you've put in to get us to treat one another as equals and keep us from fighting, I suppose it's no surprise you refused to intervene if trouble were to break out again. Tato, perhaps you could find some idea of how we might address the situation. I could call Ursaluna. <laughs> Ursaluna, so he had Warden Kalaba found you worthy? Oh, so he and Warden Kalaba found you worthy? That's perfect then. Ursaluna should be able to sniff out Arizu wherever she's gone. If you're strong enough that Ursaluna deemed you worthy, you should be ready to quell Lilijan's frenzy as well. 
I'll head to Lilijin's seat then. Rava Arena, it's called. If you'll excuse me. Listen well, Otada. You must quell any Pokemon that can cause harm to the people of Hisui. Always remember, we came here to make a new home, or we can live without war or strife. I like to gargle gravel for breakfast. It really gives me the timber and the tone that I need out of my voice. And we can... I hear reports one of those mass outbreaks out there. Stay safe, kid. A mass outbreak of Cricketune. Interdasting, as they say. That girl who set out earlier must have been eating some of Benny's potato mochi. I could smell them on her. That reminds me, I've seen Mistress Calaba riding around on that Ursaluna she serves. Digging for treasure in the ground. I wonder if Ursaluna uses his sense of smell to suss out where the treasure might be. Ursaluna knows Arizu's scent. Follow the blue signals to find her. Oh my goodness. It's going sicko mode. I don't care about Cricket Tune right now, to be honest. Oh, this thug cannot jump. Okay. Can't make that jump, can you? Okay, let's try this again. Alright, he's going sicko mode. Treasure. she is. Oh, Otano, how did you, how did it all go with Ursaluna? Calmed him down. Ah, oh, you really are strong, but how do you find me all the way out here? From the potato mochi. You followed the scent of potato mochi I bought at the wallflower? Man, I wish I'd go eat some more of those right now. Jubilee Village sure was a lot of fun. My luck's run out, though, as you can most likely tell. I got chased by a Pokemon and sprained my ankle pretty bad as I was running away. Seems like the world wants to punish me. Ah, there you are. Arizu, right? Eek! M Mistress Kalaba, I, I, I didn't... I owe you an apology. 
I treated you with disrespect, thinking you were just some whelp from the Diamond Clan. I'm sorry for that. I should have treated you better. Uh, wait, but... It's not your fault that Lilijin became frenzied, nor that my Ursaluna was so enraged. You were trying to help them both, weren't you? I didn't even have the courtesy to listen to you. You'd think someone who's lived as long as I have would be more patient. It's okay, I didn't do a good job explaining myself either. Ursula only started acting weird after he got too close to Lilijin and smelled her perfume. She was already frenzied by that point, so I'm sure that's what caused it. Ah, that explains the strange powder I found on Ursaluna. Must have been the powder from Lilijin. What happened to your leg, dear? I was gathering ingredients to make bombs, but I, I fell and I sprained my ankle. See, the reason I went to Jubilee was to get help for Ursaluna and also learn about crafting. But while I was there, I bumped into Professor Laventon and he told me about the bombs you used to quell Cleavor. So I thought I'd make some for Lilijin using her favorite foods. You galaxy people know all sorts of things. I'd like to learn even more from you, really. Well, then we better take care of our lady and get all this mess resolved first. Adamant! What were you thinking, doing all this yourself? Didn't you think I couldn't help you? Though, no one would blame you for thinking so. Not much of a leader, am I? I've never even seen Almighty Sinnoh with my own eyes. I failed to imagine that Illigent might have become frenzied, too. Listen up, Otato. I'll take the bombs that Arizu made and meet you at the Brava Arena. Don't you worry, Arizu. Otato will calm the little gent down, and that will be that. Things will should be able to settle down. Head to Brava Arena, Otato. That's where little gent's seat lies. Arizu will be taken care of. My dear Bibarel and I will make sure she reaches her lady. Bibarel. You're all so kind. Alright, well, I'm glad that she's not a villain. I was gonna be like, ah, oh, if she's like a bad guy, that, that'd be kind of lame. Oh. Yeah, I'm out of here. You gotta go fast or something. Oh. Uh, let's see, it's quite a way through, huh? Uh, I press B to jump. Uh, okay. So where can I go? I don't know. Oh, fuck. Ah, oh, fuck water. I'm drowning. Oopsies. Be more careful. Oh, there's another one here. So I, I can't go this way, can I? Um. All right. Ursa's rain, really? Like Ursa rain? Wow. gonna get over there though. 
Who's this over here? It's like one of them Diamond Clan bozos. What's up, nerd? I could have sworn one of the Pokemon in that mass outbreak was a different color from the others. We go shiny. Oh, I like this song. It's a comfy track. Oh, is this where the Diamond Clan lives? Unusual to see a visitor here at our settlement. Rumor has it you Galaxy Team folk are making a Pokédex? I'd sure love to see it when it's done. I wish I had a Pokémon buddy that would defend me if I got attacked by Pokémon out in the wilds. But what Pokémon would ever fight by my side? Thanks to the noble Pokémon, we've finally gained some semblance of a normal life here. A long time coming, I'll tell you that. In the Diamond Clan, we make curatives using medicinal leaks and the like, sure. But I hear the Galaxy team knows how to craft a huge variety of useful items. Seems we need to get with the times. Whenever a wild Pokemon attacks, we summon Lady Liljan and rely on her for protection. Not much we can do by ourselves against Pokemon, after all. This one time, Ursaluna really helped me out by finding an item I lost. So I hope I can talk more with the Pearl Clan people real soon. Clover used to be in the Survey Corps of the Galaxy Team. Wonder what she's doing now. Did you know Adamant is Mai's little brother? Well, they're not really related, but they're all siblings all the same, and I'm their littlest sister. Wait, how does that work? I don't know. You're from the Galaxy Team, aren't you? Do you know of a medicine that can cure headaches? I need it for my Psyduck. I live with... I live together with these little ones, and I can tell they've been suffering terribly. I wish I could do something to help, but... None of the medicines I've tried have all worked at all. I don't think I read that correctly. There's so many people in the Galaxy Team, surely you must have some sort of healer. Please, could you ask them for some medicines? Sure. Um, I can bash out to the diamond settlement. That's cool. I think uh, maybe I'll call it for now for here. This seems like a pretty nice place to set up for the... Oh, I'm not... Oh, okay, I had to wait for that to finish. Okay, so let's save that. And uh, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Have a good one, and bye-bye.